Hi all my beautiful friends. Today's video is my Boohoo haul. Um, I got quite a few dresses. I actually got three tops this time and I'm pleasantly surprised to tell you that I got a pair of shoes that are now probably one of my favorite sandals. Um, they were right around $20 which is incredible and they fit amazing and the quality to be frank was really really good. Um, I actually had to contact their customer service which I will tell you in the first clip my experience with their customer service which you know just a little surprise or just a little um sneaky peek was really good their customer service was amazing um so this is my haul so if you're interested in seeing all of my boohoo outfits that i got keep watching i hope you definitely subscribe if you like my personality and stick around um definitely give me a thumbs up and please leave comments i love reading through them and answering you guys back right away it really makes my day so if you're interested in seeing everything definitely keep watching Okay, you guys, so the very first dress that I got, um, I'll go into detail about the shoes a little bit later, but is this gorgeous tiered dress. Um, it is stunning. Let's start with the top. It has like these beautiful um, little buttons that are kind of like the marbly brown ones. It does have a little bit of a belt. Now, this is what I thought that dress from the last haul was going to be similar to, but this is stunning. You're definitely going to have to wear it on more of a cooler evening or day um it is quite heavy it does feel lined it's super gorgeous it has elastic sleeves so you can adjust the length i like it kind of hitting at my elbow it's kind of like a puffy sleeve this dress is so stunning i love it so much the only thing that would have made it more perfect was little pockets but this is probably my favorite dress i've ever owned period other than my floral dress this is probably the best dress i love it so much i love the color everything um it was super inexpensive i think it was like 17 dollars. now this is the first time i've ever had to get in touch with their customer service um this dress did come with a tear on the side um the customer service answered me in one hour um they do not do exchanges but they returned they refunded the money immediately i had it i think two days later which was incredible where I repurchased the dress. Um, they would not exchange it, which is okay. They did refund it. I asked if they wanted me to mail the dress back. They said no, recycle it or gift it or try to fix it, whatever I wanted to do with it, which I thought was amazing. I was able to fix the tear on the side. I use fabric tape. So when I do get the new dress, I will be gifting it to somebody or um, you know, donating it something because this dress is too gorgeous to not share. So I just want to say their customer service their customer service was amazing and i've dealt with pretty shitty customer service from other places and again they got back to me in an hour refunded me the money immediately were very polite understanding apologetic and i thought it was amazing all i had to do was send a picture of the rip and there was no issue but geez this dress come on guys it's beautiful very very beautiful I just love this khaki brown and I just think this would look gorgeous on anyone. So definitely my favorite pick. Okay, so the next dress I got was their blush smock dress. It is the softest. This material is so, so soft and it's going to be so comfortable on days that are hot. Um, all the sizes that I got were 18s. I think I need to go down to a 16 because I feel like if it was just a little bit tighter on this like i can show you if it was just a smidge tighter the dress would have fit a little nicer but you know what it's about comfortability right now but i definitely should have went down to probably a 16. for reference my tops are usually anywhere between a 1x or a small 2x it just depends and i wear a 16 in jeans um 16 or 18 just depends and i usually wear like an extra large in stretchy leggings or something like that or 1x whichever fits me but those are usually my sizes so I guess I could have definitely went down one I could probably have the dress taken in my grandmother could definitely take it in for me if I was that concerned but yeah this is this cute little just smock dress it let's see what I mean by it's a little big um it definitely has a low cut in the front it has the little longer sleeve with the ruffle that I love it's just this cute tannish blush um, on camera, it looks more tan. In person, it's just a little more pink to it. So it will definitely look pretty with a tan um, and just a pair of sandals to run around with. I think that's the only thing I might do is just see if my grandmother can maybe 
take it in a little bit um it's just a little big but i do love it and it's very comfortable especially if you're just running errands or running around the house cleaning this is not cleaning but like if you're running errands and you're just kind of sitting around the house on a weekend this dress is definitely comfortable and it was under 15 dollars, and i really like it so it's just they're wrinkly because um i just got them in the mail and i have to wash everything and kind of just hang everything up so they're not as wrinkly but i think these kind of dresses are a pain in the neck they usually wrinkle pretty easily but yeah i liked this dress and i thought it was really great for summer and it's going to look really nice just hanging out in so this was the second dress that i got okay so the next outfit i got i bought these long biker shorts i bought another pair of them i really like the way they hit um they're very soft and comfortable and i think they were only like five dollars um i just wanted to switch it up and try some other things from there some tops i really love these biker shorts i think they fit really nice and if you are somebody who suffers from maybe like having your inner thighs rub and or your i always have trouble with my shorts rolling up i find it to be very uncomfortable and annoying so these are incredible i'm so excited that these are coming back in style i don't even know if they were ever in style but i'm glad they're coming in style so we can wear them these are amazing um, and this is just a frilly little top. At first, I didn't know if I liked it, but I think it goes pretty good together. It's not terrible. Let me move my hair. The sleeves are kind of short for me, but they're they're okay. They cover everything, and they're just like, it's kind of hard to tell because it's so dark. Um, it's just like a baby doll top. It hits right under the bust, sort of like all the dresses that I have, and it's just this flowy little top that you could wear with jean shorts. This would look cute. It actually doesn't look bad together. I wasn't sure how it was gonna look. Um, I don't wear black often because I like a lot of color. Um, that's just who I am. I know some people love black and just solid kind of like um, neutral colors, but I'm not always into like black, but I thought I would try it out. I think this will look really cute. Um, and I could wear it year round. I could wear a turtleneck under it in the winter if I wanted to, but I thought it was really light and comfortable and it actually looks pretty cute with these biker shorts. So I will show you the other two shirts that I got, um, and we will keep it moving. Okay. I forgot to tell you the shirt that I got in the, um, like the baby doll puffy sleeve shirt just before was a 16. I did get this in a 20 because I thought I'd want it to be a little baggy, but I just want you to know their t-shirts definitely, unless it says baggy or made for tall women, I definitely would up go up a size. They are quite tight. I mean, unless you like that, um, I just expected these to be kind of baggier so I could wear them over my shorts. I did love this, so I'm going to wear it. I'm probably going to wear it more with like jean shorts to kind of tuck me in a little bit better. It's this cute little um, like uh, cheetah print. It says J'adore Paris. Um, really inexpensive, uh, nice quality. It's just, you know, your regular t-shirt. I just don't love how it kind of hugs down here on my tummy. But for running around in, if you know, if you had like a sport thing for your kid, you know, this summer, all the kids playing basketball and stuff, this is just perfect to throw on and go. I really like the length of these shorts. I think these look great. These are the same shorts. I only bought the one pair just to see because sometimes um, I don't love this length on me. Um, these are from my previous haul. I just wanted to try them on. I hadn't worn them yet. So I figured I would try them on because I didn't try them on in the last video, but I love these. I think these are great. Okay, so the next band t-shirt, they had a lot of band t-shirts or like musician t-shirts. And I thought this shirt was amazing. Obviously it's Tupac. I did go up higher in this size. I got this one in a 22. And the, as you can see, this one definitely fits a lot nicer. Um, I really, really love this. I obviously bought three black shirts, which I usually don't do. But I love that they offer really inexpensive like band tees and musician tees because like something at this, something like this at like Hot Topic or Spencer's would be probably 20 bucks. And I think this was like eight bucks or 10 bucks. So I know they can be super pricey and they have all kinds of cool t-shirts like graphic t uh, design t-shirts for like eight to 10 bucks, which I love. And I thought this would look really cool this summer. Um, just with biker shorts or with jean shorts i just needed a couple of actual like tops i have so many dresses for the summer but sometimes you know it's just not practical and i need something easy to go run around in and i thought this t-shirt was really cool so yeah super inexpensive like i said this would have been really really expensive at like hot topic or something and it's like just regular 
you know, Walmart t-shirt. It's not anything special. You're definitely getting something a little bit cheaper because you're paying only eight bucks, but it's not bad quality. You know what I mean? It's not, it's just a regular t-shirt. Like I literally could buy this at Hot Topic. It'd be the same exact thing. So it isn't bad. I don't want you to think that. Now, I don't know how it's going to wash because as you can hear, it's that weird material wash. If it's going to peel, then I will definitely let you know. I will put it down in the, the description when I do wash it just to let you know. So either it's a pass or, you know, go ahead and buy it. Um, if that doesn't matter to you, you definitely could buy it. Um, I don't ever put my clothes in the dryer. I always air dry because I am concerned about shrinking. So I wash them in the washing machine on cold water and then I obviously air dry either in the house in the wintertime or in the summer, I will stick them outside. Okay, the next little summer dress I got, um, this one's also in an 18. It's just this cute little white and yellow polka dotted dress. Very, very summery. And this cute little um, ruffle sleeve. I don't know why I couldn't think of it. I love the length of the sleeve. Um, it's very modest, so if you don't like really showing any cleavage, it's still that really feminine v-neck, but it doesn't show much. Hits right under the bust, and it's a decent length. Um, I noticed that some of the dresses in my previous haul were very short, but these are all very good. They hit right above the knee, right at the knee, so I like that. Um, definitely don't have to worry if you bend down and, you know, showing your behind. But I thought this was really cute, not much to say. Really inexpensive, just one of those, like, cute little smock baby doll dresses. And I just thought the pattern was super cute. I have nothing like it. I don't have anything this pale yellow color. So I think it's really cute, and it's going to look great for this summer. Okay, so this dress is so cute. This screamed like picnics and 4th of July and parties and barbecues to me. It looks like a picnic table um, tablecloth, which I love. It's There's nothing wrong with it. It's just this adorable white and pink um, striped polka dotty dress with this beautiful like bell sleeve, this long like bell sleeve. I think that's what it would be called. I love this neckline. Now, I usually don't love these like rounder necklines i prefer like a v cut but this looks so cute and i know it kind of looks like the dress before but it's very very different it hits directly under the bust but it doesn't have like a major flare it's kind of straight so i wasn't sure if i was going to love it but i do i know it just gives me such like fourth of july picnic vibes and now we can kind of see our family and friends again i'm just so excited for the fourth of july it's literally I know this is going to sound weird other than Christmas, 4th of July is my favorite time of the year. You get to be with your family, no attachments, you just enjoy your friends and family, barbecues and fireworks. You know, you don't exchange gifts, you just bring food and enjoy each other's company. So I think this is going to be perfect. And the 4th of July, I always wear red lipstick every 4th of July. I paint my nails for the 4th of July and I always wear something fun and festive. So this might be my 4th of July outfit. I know it's not like red, white, and blue, but it does look like a picnic table tablecloth, and I just love it. I think it's great. It was super inexpensive. It's so light. I think it's going to be super comfortable because it is going to be so, so hot on the 4th of July, but I think this will be absolutely perfect. Okay, so here are the amazing shoes that I got. I got these in a seven and a half. Um, I wish they had come in nude. I can't remember if they did. If they do, I think I'm going to buy myself a pair. These are amazing. They have about a um two and a half inch heel but they're not uncomfortable at all um usually i do more of a square toe but i actually really love these and i love the ankle strap i think these look incredible on they're so easy to walk in now they are slippery a little bit you know how like when you first get a pair of sandals or like high heels the bottoms are a little slippery that's all but nothing like too dangerous or scary but i think these look so flattering on I think these are going to be great for upcoming like parties for the 4th of July and you know just barbecues as you can see they are so cute on I think these are always amazing I always look at these when I'm at Target but they're always like a much higher heel and they're just impractical and I've come to the realization like not to buy shoes that I'm not going to wear I'm trying to like not do that but these are so comfortable I wore them around the house the other day just to see if they were something that was practical and they are amazing. I think they look so sexy on women on the feet. These are amazing. I love the little strap. I don't have small like calves or legs or ankles and they fit great. I put them usually on the third or fourth little strap um, and they fit great. 
and again for reference these are a seven and a half they were right around 20 bucks and i took them in my put them in my cart and took them out put them in took them out and finally i was like you know what i just want to see what their quality of shoe is like and i highly recommend these these are amazing and they did make some shoes like in wide um for women that have a little bit of a wider foot because i know some people have struggled with that um but these are incredible and i highly highly recommend them okay you guys this dress is incredible i love it so much for summer winter time i'm very very big into warm tones or very neutral and warm tones summer i like color and vibrant stuff i don't wear a lot of blue but I'm trying to incorporate it more. Like I said, I love warm tones, but this blue is just stunning. It's like this, it's just a baby blue. It has elastic in the sleeve where, and you can kind of adjust the, you know, the height of your sleeve. Um, and it has this beautiful ruffle, this deep V neckline. This is so feminine and cute. I kept the shoes on so you could see like what it would look like together. It's so feminine, so adorable. Let me fix my hem there i love it it hits perfect it hits right at the knee it's just the most beautiful dress i think this is my second favorite other than the very first dress with the tan i think this dress is amazing i mean you could even if you didn't have a tan but with the tan it's amazing this color is stunning and like i said i'm not like really big into like pinks and blues and purples um, but boy, this dress is beautiful. It almost is changing my mind about blue. So I love it. And it's like a heavy, nice material, but still light enough that it's going to be perfect for this summer. Probably my second, if not my favorite dress. This dress is just so beautiful on. It reminds me a lot of the gray dress I had in my first haul. Um, I think that's why I picked this out just to see it. It, it might be actually the same dress and just a different color, but boy, this is like stunning. I love this dress so much. So we have two more dresses and then that will be all. Okay, so this dress is absolutely beautiful too. It's again that beautiful like um, periwinkle-y kind of blue, I think, or maybe just like a sky blue. It has this really pretty detail on the bust. It hits right under the bust. Again, with the pretty V-neck neckline. Um, obviously, I would wear maybe like a push-up bra with this. Great sleeve, and it's just more of a straight down dress, which I actually like. And it looks great with these shoes. This is one of my favorite dresses. And this dress was only $9. Yep, only nine bucks. This dress is great for like a date night, going out. You could probably dress it up, dress it down if you really wanted to. I think it's a great dress and it's one of my favorites. So yep, love this dress. And we have one more and that will be all. Okay, you guys, so this is the last dress. This dress is so cute probably like my third favorite it's just this new dress with this blue cheetah print but the sleeves are kind of what sold me these are just like bell sleeves very 70s very retro-y I think this dress is very like I said 70s vibes I love the neckline I think that looks really cute and like a chunky necklace with this and big hoop earrings and maybe like a platform sandal you are right back in the 70s this dress is so much fun i would probably wear my hair up in a ponytail with it um just to get out of the way i think this dress is so much fun and again these sleeves are what sold me i love the way it looks it's just the print is so cute and i think this would look great on anybody i think this dress is adorable and i think it was like 14 bucks so really worth it great material not see-through at all super duper cute and i love it so much and even if you wore these shoes it looks great i mean these show shoes are pretty versatile they've gone with the last few dresses that i put on and i love it but this dress is so cute and i think it would look great on anybody i really do so that is the last dress okay you guys that is the end of my boohoo haul sadly um everything was really impressive this time i don't think i disliked anything that i got which was really exciting and different for a change because I think there was a few things in my last haul that I wasn't thrilled with but definitely loved everything that fit and it all fit really well this time so I hope you stick around and subscribe if you like my personality and give me a chance to get to know me um definitely leave me comments like I said I just enjoy them so so much definitely thumbs up if you like this video if you have any requests feel free to leave them down below and I will see you all next time bye guys